Hi Cancer, welcome in, you're watching The Sacred Sun Tarot. And these are going to be your messages for the upcoming week, right? Of course, your suggestions are always welcome. You can connect with me on Instagram. We have two of pentacles here. A tough choice or exploring better options. Cancer Moon Rising, Venus, Jupiter and Sun, right? Let's see what messages we have for you. Page of Pentacles, okay. A lot of cards of Pentacles, Cancer. Some money situation, something related to your work. Or planning to invest into something. We have four of wands reversed as well. So coming out of a connection or not feeling like home in a situation. Not feeling very uh, comfortable in something. Okay, let's start it. Cancer. So we have Queen of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy can be your energy also. Cutting through the confusion, cutting through the clouds, planning to be vocal, asking for logic, giving clarity, right? So I think this is an angry mode on <laughs> Seven of Pentacles. Maybe you were waiting for some response. You were waiting for some conversation from someone and probably this person was delaying everything. If you're dealing with a, a female and you are a male in this situation, then this person is angry and they're very clear in their words, right? Okay. Cancer. Recent past. We have Chariot, Nine of Pentacles and Wow, Empress. So I think intentionally you released something in the recent past and uh, you became sing single either or this is more like emotional and financial independence, right? Cancer, your own energy, very, very energetic, full of willpower. You know you're going to succeed and victory is yours. You decided this is more like an energy where the decision has already been made. You're very confident about your direction and your plans and you're all already on the chariot now you just have to move right and this is these are the energies which shows me that you're very really happy about the situation whatever you have decided for this is motherly support fertility success and some authority as well right so i see a lot of growth and progress in this direction Where I, wherever you're heading this is going to bring in a lot of independence for you for some of you you have released some kind of cords with somebody and now you feel independent jolly and excited for something fresh in your life cutting cords and being very happy about the growth this is about to come to your life or this is already your energy luxurious lifestyle happy mood spending money on your self grooming you know very positive energy this also can mean that uh, you're spending money on your lifestyle changes good habits luxurious habits can be for some of you right getting a spa or a <laughs> beautiful um, manicure pedicure done something like very luxurious and healing relaxing also right moving further let's see what is happening in the current situation definitely moved on from something right oh my god cancer you have wonderful energy this week wonderful energy two of cups sun and the page of cups now this is love this is love growth happiness willpower love what can be better than this right maybe you recently released something you were happy and independent and boom can be new love relationship can be proposal can be a date for someone i also see that if this week you are planning to go on a date with somebody i see you very excited you're getting all set prepared and getting your nails done getting your hair done buying new clothes <laughs> very exciting energy to have this date to meet somebody to see someone or maybe you are going somewhere, you know that you're about to meet somebody and uh, this is very happening. You are very happy about it. Sun in the center of the reading. This week is full of excitement I'm picking up, right? Page of Cups, you might be getting some messages here regarding this date, some updates, some compliments. 
Okay. Five of Pentacles energy. This can be somebody who left you out in cold in past and maybe this person was not responding. For some of you, I'm picking up that you are recently coming out of something and in the recent past, you were feeling some kind of cold emotions. So now you are in total fresh energies. Maybe meanwhile, this person might come back and apologize that I shouldn't have said that, I shouldn't have done that. But I think your energies have changed completely and you do not bother about it any further, right? Let's see what messages we have further. Wonderful messages cancel. We're going to clarify a few cards, right? Knight of Pentacles. So now things are leveling up, right? Uh, if this started as something very casual, exciting but casual, I think a slow moving, very stable opportunity might come in. Someone might be interested in taking this to the further level. Two of Cups, the date is going really well if you were on a date. And I think something very unexpected is also happening here because you are in some new mood, fresh energies and someone can see that probably the one who left you out in cold who didn't respond to your messages or had no idea that this will be so quick that you will just go on another date you will find someone new in your surroundings and it's totally a shock for this person right so maybe they are also trying to contact you or they might try to contact you again with some um, reasons some kind of um, messages okay what else we have moon here of course disappointment and the knight of wands energy somewhere at heart uh a cancer i still feel that you remember it you remember those emotions as you move further you're moving very slow you don't want to make any mistakes you can see the proposal has a big capacity of future and opportunity to take things to the next level but somewhere at heart you still remember some emotions which uh, kind of disappoint you right uh, for some of you i'm picking up that uh, you sometimes slip back to those energies you sometimes uh, get cold feet because uh, this is fresh and beautiful moreover this new passion has some kind of uh, energy i'm picking up to switch your mind switch your uh, aura but knight of wands energy i think you want to play safe towards the end i see that you're very excited you are full in fire but you still want to play safe this i don't see this is in and out but i see somehow commitment is on the back seat right now okay there's love there's compassion there's growth there's excitement there's happiness but when you remember the past when you remember some issues related to the past you keep the commitment thing on the back seat for a time being this can be energy where let's go out more let's have some more dates let's flirt around a bit and uh, i don't really feel that you want to explore options but uh, for most of you i pick up that you want to take it slow and explore passion right commitment right now is not the thing you're looking for probably or the other way around right let's clarify a few cards cancer i see very exciting messages here overall this week is full of excitement and happiness i'm picking up dating partying uh, feeling independent spending money on yourself and spending some luxurious days <laughs> okay so what is this chariot energy where are you planning to go what is this chariot energy we have the ten of wands the tower and the eight of cups you definitely walked away from something recently cancer and uh, you're totally over it with the chariot empress and the moon energy i'm sorry the sun energy you're totally over it that was burdening that was somehow pulling you back uh, I'm also listening against the tides, against the waves. Somewhere at heart, you had an idea that this is not going to happen, but you were still putting in effort and boom, something which was on the shaky grounds is uh, falling apart or maybe it just got over, right? Tower moment, friction, unexpected changes and you walked away. Now, after walking away, I see that there was an aura, excitement in your energies. Whatever happened in past, it's now in past and now you're very excited for new things coming up for you. What is this Empress energy? Beautiful Empress energy, growth, success, 
authority, fertility. We have the five, the six of swords again, moving on energy, right? Also the temperance. This is the energy of healing. And again, again, uh, when I look towards the temperance and the empress energy here, I see that you're spending some time on your personal healing and relaxation. This can be spending money on your uh, satisfaction, going to spa, going to some wow this is very healing you know this is very tempting kind of energy where you want to spend some time aloof in some good uh, atmosphere where people can pamper you or you can pamper yourself right very beautiful pampering energy moving on with a very graceful charm here amazing what is this temperance nine of cups can you see the beautiful cards coming out if, if this is not the thing happening right now or this is not the thing that happened right now I see that you're definitely shifting your aura and energy and you're moving towards self-satisfaction self-love and self-pampering which is of course very important right sometimes very important what is the Sun two of cups and Sun beautiful energy what is the Sun energy coming your way we have the knight of cups oh my god cancer this is so much love oh my god two of cups three of pentacles oh they're craving to work over this the situation we have the king of wands here aries leo sag someone is just ready to work over it i don't know whether you know this person already or not i don't see two ace of cups which is uh, mostly the significator of new love so it can be somebody you already knew or somebody from your past or somebody who is already in your surroundings right knight of cups two of cups two of cups again and the three of pentacles they are very sure that they have to and they want to work on this connection right and i think this conversation is going to make you feel very happy if you're going on a new date if you are planning to meet someone new this time not the one you're walking away from but somebody uh, fresh in your surroundings this is a big yes yes right what is the state of cups for cancer three of wands now uh probably the one who broke your heart who left you out in cold is also coming back with an apology wow this is interesting now three of wands you turned around you, you, you are just looking for the sun to rise and probably you're not very interested in uh, responding to anybody as such you're just enjoying the new fresh things around you King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Someone is very interested in making a call here, right? Page of Cups, the apology, the call for meeting again. I can I cannot say reconciliation straight away, but yes, some messages. What is this Three of Wands energy? I think you're not very interested. Oh, oh beautiful. The High Priestess in reversed. So someone wants to reveal some secrets now cancer they want to come back and tell you something maybe in the past when you were the one only one putting an effort in the direction of working over this connection they were just not available you felt that i'm the only one working and shaky grounds to have a moment boom now they want to come back apologize and reveal the secrets they want you to know why they did not put an effort what was the problem when you were waiting on to them and why they were not available i see four of cups they're very dissatisfied about something ace of cups big cup here what is this high priestess reversed what are they willing to tell cancer now knight of wands yes i think this person had a problem in commitment right the moon again moon and nine of knight of wands energy i think cancer they had some problems some commitment issues right they want to apologize because probably you were the best thing ever happened to them and they were just not ready to accept it the way you were putting in effort cancerians are beautiful partners and the way they love water signs the way they are emotional and the way they are indulged into relationships it is just next level right and probably they were not ready to settle down i see aries energy i see sad energy i see leo energy they want to apologize because they were in and out and they were not ready to settle down in the in the beginning in past now i think the energy is changing now they both the new love and the past love they both are here cancer and now you have to decide you remember the past you might be not very happy about 
some happenings in your surroundings what is this moon what is disappointing here why you feel disappointed we have the hanged man the page of swords and the page of cups now this apology is stressing you out we have the emperor someone very strong someone very controlling aries energy this can be the energy you are embracing right now you want to set the boundaries you want to hold it very tight right now when uh when you get the information that someone is still stuck on you this can be your energy where probably you were not waiting on to this person but somehow you were waiting on for an apology you felt something very intense and sometimes in our subconscious we attach our emotions to somebody and feel that you need a closure right maybe you were waiting for some closure you were waiting for some messages and you were not able to move forward and that's why you were hanging page of swords very guarded very skeptical yet looking for information and checking out the moves of the other person and the moment the apology comes in page of cups you become more skeptical you become more guarded and i think that's the energy of moon here that i know you are non-committal i know you are in and out you are full of passion but you don't know how to settle down and for this i cannot sacrifice these beautiful energies which are coming towards me you might not be involved completely in that direction for time being but this passionate person keeps on coming back uh, I think uh, this week you definitely have to make a choice and you planned of walking away from this person you were quite happy also about it but now when they again come back with an apology this is uh, kind of traumatizing for some of you right and at the same time you want to hold it very tight what is this knight of wands energy what is this knight of wands energy for cancer we have two of wands and king of swords okay someone is making a very logical decision here and they can be cold queen of swords with the king of swords they can be very cold gemini libra aquarius energy and seven of swords uh think at least five times before moving towards this person cancer because uh, they have a big passion for you they probably are not able to leave you they're very excited when you are around, but they have severe commitment issues. Knight of Wands, King of Swords, Two of Wands. They might say that I'm making a decision, which is very logical, and uh, this has to be this way. But I think you still doubt their intentions and your intuition is perfectly honest here, right? So Seven of Swords energy, be very careful when you trust, trust this person or when you get ready to work with them i see there is there is another opportunity which is making you feel very happy make a wise choice here that's the only message i'm getting right cancer honesty beautiful honesty will ultimately be rewarded so queen of swords king of swords high priestess and reversed now this is honest conversation sometimes blunt sometimes rude sometimes vocal but honest swords are hurtful right swords are hurtful sometimes and honesty hurts right most of the time when somebody is painfully honest they have a capacity to hurt you and i think they're revealing the secret here that i'm i'm here only for passion or i'm here only because uh, I'm so attracted to you. You sweep me off my ground, but uh, I'm not here to commit, right? Or maybe they have commitment issues. They have some background problems. They cannot commit. Perspective. Examine your situation from the higher perspective. You might be having um, a conflict here right now, Cancer. I see some kind of five of wands energy, troubled, conflicting energy here. But if you look in this situation if you look towards the situation from some other perspective i see that you will see the honest reason behind it right why now this person is coming back and being honest with you why now this person is sharing this stuff with you why now they are revealing the secrets because you are on the verge of something better and universe is asking you to reveal something related to past that was not meant for you and you were still hanging and getting um somehow you were delaying everything which is coming towards you because your energies were still connected to this past person who was dishonest and in and out 
So because you are on the verge of something very beautiful and positive in your life, a lot of positive cards and the sun is in the center of the reading. So that's the reason universe wants you to look at the picture from a different perspective. You might feel that why is this person coming back to me now? But the reality is maybe they want to give you a closure or universe wants you to have a closure or look at the picture from a different perspective, right? So very interesting messages, very happy week, fresh dates, fresh excitement, good news. Only disappointing part can be that this person might return or some information about them or some secrets about them might get revealed, right? So these are the messages for cancer for the week. Thank you so much guys for watching. Bye-bye.